All right, well, I'm sitting here with Matthew Smith of Squared Eye, Pattern Tap fame. Um, just wanted to take a minute to grab you while you were here and uh, cool. ask you about what you have going on. Um, but first, you know, you talk about beer a lot. I just wanted to corner you and ask you, what about beer and design gets you so charged up? That's a good question. Um, well, beer came before design for me. So. <laughs> yeah. Um, and uh, I used to work for a New Belgium brewery out in uh, Fort Collins, Colorado. Really? Yeah. Okay. And uh, loved working for them and, and still enjoy their beers to the, you know, to the most degree. Uh, but they've in some ways become sort of the Starbucks of beers for me um, as I've gotten into more and more fine, nuanced, detailed beers. And I've had to spend a lot of time with um, beer, which thankfully hasn't been too hard, um, <laughs> to get into the, the nuanced details right. of flavors, of different styles, okay. of, of really researching, understanding it. Uh, not unlike web design, I've gotten into brewery uh, and, and trying to understand you know, the brewing process. Wow. Um, and I'm not a, a beer brewer, I, you know, just the same. I'm not a web coder, um, but I do know enough to know the process and I can speak about the tastes. Um, and so in the same way, web design has worked that way for me. Um, it's a great metaphor. It ended up working really well for me. And, you know, it's, uh, it would not, I would not be, it would not be authentic to have a metaphor around like cat ownership. Sure. I hate cats, you know, so <laughs> that would not work. Um, Whereas beer, He's I, he loves cats, right? No. <laughs> um, and so this this works really well for me because I really enjoy beer and it's something I can talk about. And I think um, the same way that like John Hicks loves cheese, right. um, you know. And I I'm don't sorry, know, beer's more fun. That's right. I agree. <laughs> sorry, John. Um, but you know, um, like Elliot J. Stocks and I share this in common, and we really enjoy going after it. And it's just a it's a fun way to to break away. And then we started Beardy right. um, which is a way to, it's essentially, we're taking um, the FAC club, Friday afternoon club, mm -hmm. and we've rebranded it. Beardy So I like that. what's interesting is that Beardy is happening all over the world. People just don't know it yet. Oh, I see. Right. Um, <laughs> so, so we're trying to, movement. that's right. So we're trying to rebrand it. And what, what we're trying to do is beer creates an opportunity for people to get together and not just talk about web not just talk about business but talk about life talk about things that are interesting to them and so we're getting people coming to these things that are engaging about design but actually are um you know in the industrial right. you know design or maybe they're um a pastor or maybe they're um uh, they work at a grocery store right. i don't know right. but they're coming and we're having interesting dialogue and people are learning stuff so it's a lot of fun and they're drinking beer and they're drinking great beer and getting <laughs> beer education we just started this thing where it's like we're doing blind tasting and some of that That's as cool. well um, and a great group in Greenville, um, Orange Coat, which does some really nice web design. They did a neat thing where they're trying to help people understand food tasting so that they can talk about design better. Okay. That's so, another good analogy. Yeah. So Beer there's a lot out there. Fun. I agree. Um, well, while I've got you here, I want to talk about Pattern Tap. Cool. Because I've seen Alpha Pattern Tap. Yep. And uh, just what's your what's your vision for Pattern Tap? Where are you taking it? That's a, that's a great question. Well, the first thing is uh, it's been really interesting to see how people respond to Alpha and understanding the idea of Alpha. Uh, we put it out there very, like, raw. You know? yeah, I we just that. really yeah. wanted to see where is this going. We wanted to give people the process, and people have not responded that well to it. It's been interesting. Really? Some people love the idea, but they feel like it's finished. Um, okay. And I don't know if it's because of our history of putting out really nice finished work, mm. but um, people didn't get the idea of alpha. Like, I don't know what's pre-alpha or what says that better, yeah. but <laughs> that was our intention to say, this is raw. That's this is this is in process. So do you think you're actually fighting your brand? Because the Squared Eye brand is all about, like like you said, like minute detail, like yeah. really going over the top on delivering a super polished product. You think you're fighting your brand a little bit? Maybe. Uh, but maybe we're saying, hey, our brand has a little more room than you thought. Right. Um, so we're, we're addressing some interesting things. But the, the big vision for Pattern Tap is, I think, really fun. We're going after not just web patterns, but we're going to separate out into different divisions. So information architecture okay. dot pattern tap dot com, you know, IA dot pattern tap dot com. Um, the iPhone dot pattern tap dot com, okay, cool. um, you know, or maybe mobile. Um, we're going to look at uh, web applications, e-commerce, and actually separate things 
these things out. They'll share a number of integrations, um, but we're actually looking at turning it into a massive educational resource hub. In a in kind of a wiki style, people will be able to add uh, resource links. Uh, people will be able to add code that says, "Hey, here's how you could actually accomplish this." Cool. Um, doing some really interesting things. So, cool. we're we're really trying to figure out some good models. And uh, so far, using stuff like Get Satisfaction, right. we've right. been able to get some good feedback on how we're going to change. But for me, I I just continually think that we need to keep educating toward better standards in the web. And Pattern Tap was a way of doing that. Right. And, you know, it's helping, you know, pay my mortgage. So that's, that's working awesome. out all right, too. Well, congratulations on that. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Man. Well, thank you, Matt. Matthew. Matthew. Sorry, you know, Matt. Matthew. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you, Matthew. Thank you, Gene. <laughs>